Coach, another one down to the wire tonight. Um, how do these close games, though, help your team build on court chemistry? <laughs> I mean, we don't always set it up this way, but um, it's just a learning experience in the very beginning. You know, the first one obviously went our way. Um, the second one, you know, we just got to learn how to close out games. And you can say that early on with our fourth game in, but closing out games is, is extremely important. And um, we just came up short. I think a couple calls hurt, hurt our momentum, it, it, not to their fault, but just to our, we just couldn't recover from that. Um, we had a chance down here with Andy's foul and ball back, and Haley had a great drive in there. Um, but that miss, I think, uh, kind of stopped us a little bit from playing. But, you know, we'll get there. We'll get there. A pretty physical fourth quarter. Talk about those two calls that you mentioned earlier. What were you seeing? Um, yeah, I just I think they were in foul trouble, and, you know, we don't really have that problem because of how deep we go. But, you know, took us down a couple times pretty hard. Um, yeah. yeah. Our players. We, we really spent a lot of time of learning these new 20 new adjustments that we need to play, and, and I, I take pride in that, and, and um, so do my players. But you know, it just didn't fall our way. You know, just we look at the tapes. But um, I thought Idaho State, you know, they're they're picked to win their conference. Steve was a great coach, and you know, they did a great job tonight of just closing out games, and we'll learn a lot from that. And you guys started out a little bit slow in the first quarter, but then really got it going in the second and third, shooting just over 40%. I know it's something you guys have been working on. Yeah. Are you happy with how, what you've seen on the team so far? I think, you know, what's nice is, you know, the last game was Danny. You know, this day, you know, Autumn, I thought, came out good in the first half. And then Haley Talbert did a great job of finishing for us. Um, you know, shots go in. You know, obviously it helps. Um, I never shot 7% before until you know V game. But, you know, I think... It's it, the nice thing about our team is that anybody can kind of shoot an A night, just about whose night it is. Uh, but, you know, we just got to close them out. I think threes are nice and, and, and they're great. It's part of our offense. Um, but we got to learn how to close a game out and get the right shot at the right time and, and you know, knowing what's, what's there and not forcing things. I think we get a tendency to forcing things. And I, I think that's just, we got to wrap it. And that falls on, on myself and my staff. And then on the other side of the ball, what do you see now to your defense? Ooh. Direct line drives all day long. <laughs> we got to do a better job defensively. I think, uh, uh, you know, we have athletes. It has got to defend in space. And, you know, we, we don't like to just run man, but t just tonight with the personnel we got given, man was, was, our, was our only option. Um, they did a good job. I thought we did a good job of containing and, and switching, but uh, too, many, too many easy buckets, I thought, getting to the basket, and that, that hurt us too. All right, and you guys are heading out on the road later this week. What's the number one key for improvement? Well, you know, it's going to be a good test. We got uh, three games in three days. Um, very tough. You know, I don't schedule easy, I guess. Uh, <laughs> Illinois, UNM, and, and uh, Wichita State, who are three great programs um, off the road. Half, two of them are neutral floor. Um, for us, it's really just about playing for 40 minutes. I think, you know, you hit it on the you come first quarter kind of flat. We can't do that. You know, we got to come out for 40 minutes playing hard. I think we, we, we're capable of doing that. We just got to do it all the time. All right, thanks, Coach. And Aiders will be back in the brand November 30th. Thank you.